Welcome back everyone. In this video, we're going to learn how to implement the sorting feature in a React table. We need the basic table for several feature implementations. So let's consider this as a template. I'm going to create a new file called sortingtable.js. I'm going to copy the code from basic table and paste it in sorting table. Change the component name to sorting table. All right, now we can proceed to implement the sorting feature. We begin by importing another hook from React table, which is the use sort by hook. If you're wondering, pretty much all features in React table are implemented by importing one or the other hook. Remember, it is a table utility after all. All right, now once you import use sort by, you pass it in as the second argument to the use table hook. So after the object, use sort by. What this does is it adds the sorting feature to our table instance. The sorting feature can be directly made use of in the JSX. So on the th tag in the table header, we have destructured column dot get header props. To this method, we now pass in column dot get sort by toggle props. What this does is it adds properties related to the sorting feature on the individual column. So after rendering the column header label, we can now add in icons that represent the sorted state of the column. So I'm going to add a span tag and then within curly braces, we check if the column is sorted. If it is sorted, we check if the column is sorted in the descending order. If it is, we add an icon of sorts that represents sort by descending. If the column is sorted but not in descending order, then the column is sorted in the ascending order. So we add another appropriate icon. If the column is not at all sorted, we render an empty string. And that is pretty much it. Let's save the file, include it in app.js, and head to the browser. On page load, we have all the columns rendering the data. Now, if I click on the ID column header, you can see that the column gets sorted in the ascending order. Click again, it's sorted in the descending order. Click again and the sorting is removed. Similar is the case with other columns. First name, ascending, so starts with A, descending, Start with Z and remove sorting. Sending, descending, remove sorting. As you can see, implementing sorting is as simple as that. Once you have your basic table in place, implementing features on top of it is pretty straightforward. In the next video, let's talk about formatting columns to work well with the sorting feature that we have implemented. I'll see you guys in the next one.